And this morning, I invite us to, to bring our collective consciousness together, our individual consciousness joined together for the purpose of peace and love. And especially, we're keeping in mind the cities of El Paso and Dayton and the trauma that people there are dealing with and people all around the world who are observing it are dealing with. And what we want to do today is we want to bring our own awareness, our own consciousness to God. Emmett Fox says, turn away from your problems and turn to God. We recognize then that there is only one life. We call it God. It is perfect. It is whole. It is complete. It is 100% for itself. No part of it can be against itself. It is perfect peace. There is nothing for it to struggle with. There is nothing for it to struggle against. There is no entity in the universe that can fool it or hide from it or conspire against it. It simply is. It is perfect love because it is perfect unity. It is all things. It is one with all things. It has created us out of itself. And it has left us alone to make that discovery. We have free will. We have volition. We can choose, we can decide, we can act. And in this process of human consciousness, awakening to its divinity, to the presence of God within each and every one of us, we don't always act as divine beings. But we recognize that each and every one has that potential. And each and every one will awaken. We recognize that the span of existence that we call this life on earth is temporary. We are all passing through. Some for a short time. Some for a very long time. We are now at peace. We are now at peace in our understanding <clears throat> that the events of the world are only temporary. But the experience of love, the experience of peace, the experience of life is eternal. We reach out now and we surround each and every one who is suffering, who is crying out in pain, who is seeking understanding, who is grieving their loss. We take them in our arms and we surround them with love. There's nothing we can say. There's nothing we can do. Their sense of loss is real. Their pain is real. Their sadness is real. But all we can do 
was to be compassionate and to know the truth. This too shall pass. This too shall pass. We release and let go of that within us which divides and separates us from anyone and we invite others to do the same. For all of our problems stem from a sense of separation when the truth is unity. We wish today simply to know ourselves as an integral, important, vital part of the one. Our hearts go out. Our love goes out. Our knowledge of truth goes out. And we bless each and every one. We release this treatment to the perfect law, knowing so certainly that it is done, that we say together, and so it is.